Mr. President, if you would allow us every single week, remain standing by the way, every single week in the Senate, we close our prayer time by standing together and praying for each other. And if you would allow Chris and I to be able to do that, we'd like to do that for you today. Thank you. Father, thank you for the way that you do provide for us. Pray that you would pour your overwhelming blessing and wisdom on the president, on the vice president, his cabinet, and his team. Pray that you would energize him, that you would give him wise counsel. And in quiet moments, as he has a gap to be able to think, pray that you would guide him in the way to go, because he leads our nation. Give him the insight that he needs. Give him joy in the task and use him for your kingdom's sake and for our nation and world's sake. In the name of Jesus, I ask. Heavenly Father, we pray for all who are in positions of responsibility and authority and all who seek a closer relationship with you. This morning, we especially pray for President Trump, and we ask that your wisdom, your blessing, and your peace would be upon him and his family as they serve us, and that today you would touch his heart and all who've been with us here this morning at this national prayer breakfast. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Mr. President. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.